boy Diesel Treasel, half of the Verbalistics. I'm getting ready to go down to Dallas, or up to Dallas, to pick up these CDs for the South by Southwest show, man. The show is tomorrow. It's currently Wednesday. Super excited. You know what I'm saying? Probably more excited to go pick up these CDs, though, man. It's been a long time coming. I just want to see what they look like, man. Artwork is dope. Shout out to the home. DCO graphics. Everything look, looks good. So, uh, we're going to go see what, see what it do. This is a free project we're giving out for y'all, man. And we put a lot of money in because we believe in our craft. We don't believe in taxing y'all for it. We don't to enjoy it. And then, stay tuned and enjoy the ride. Waiting on White Mike, crazy cracker ass to come sweep a nigga. And, uh, we're going to do what we got to do. We're on our way to Dallas to pick up these CDs. Got the crazy cracker show for a white mic. So we got Antonio up to the joint for a little bit, so I think I'm educated. I can read senses. So I ain't seen a nigga read 12 years. You don't feel that. Nigga, I've been gone for 10 years. Exactly. Exactly. And I wasn't locked up either. Don't, don't let them don't let them trick you into believing that I'm some sort of felonious criminal. I don't know where the nigga was. We all have a pain. But I ain't got a pain. Pain. I think we doing something wrong. My only therapy is in the song. <laughs> if I die tonight, I would be like Uncle Phil. I spent my whole life trying to feel something real. The United States white, Justice but I want a record deal. I was acquitted of those charges that are probably too similar to OJ. You know, and they still saying that he killed the white girl. Right now is a gift, that's why they call it the present and presently I'm feeling good, I ain't her glow is for rest and currently standing at the top of the bird's eye view I see him hating, they don't tell him what them birds might do They know what they're so proud of this guy's got my back And my swapping down with Reese's before audio crack I wasn't even tempted, I was just loud That's why when I'm on the track, it's like I got a vendetta I don't want to up unless you do what I tell her So stay the hell out my way According to them, they said that I said she was one hot bitch man. I don't know about uh, you guys, but uh, you know me well enough to know that I don't speak in those terms. You're one hot looking babe. I might have said you're a bad bitch, but I wouldn't have said you're one hot looking babe. I would have said you're one hot looking babe. Enough about me, let's talk about you, Little Caesar. <laughs> hey, think about me is, if I see something I want, I take it. That's all I need to know. And I ain't got to go Little Caesar no more. And I go to Papa Perfect. And I go to Little Caesar within a hundred mile radius of Colleen, Texas. And see them hot and ready things, shit. I had to jeopardize my stipulation. They got a picture of this nigga, they just... They just don't know it's him because he had dreads back then. Yeah. That's all I, I do. I gotta do, man. I do what I gotta do. I get him where I fit in. But if I tell you give me the money, I mean just that. Obviously. Especially with the gun in your hand. I had no gun, man. I didn't need no gun. You robbed him without a gun? I had no gun. Nigga, if I had a gun, I'd have caught a felony. You know they charged me with? Yeah, I know what they would have charged me with. No, no, they ain't no charge me with. Class B stash. Wow. That was bad motherfucking. Alright, nigga got off with a mister. You goddamn right. How many niggas you know get away with that shit? And that's the difference between getting in trouble in Vegas and getting in trouble in goddamn Texas. Had that shit happened in Vegas, you would have been assault with a deadly weapon, nigga, and you didn't even have no weapon. <laughs> I, I had no work at all. I walked in there. I told a nigga something. He owed the register. I got what I needed and I left. Why don't you just brought it back? I just bring it back. They came and got my ass in the hotel room. And I didn't say nothing. And they took the money. They said, who money is this? I said, I don't know. No, I'm just saying. I'm glad not I went to here.
that ass they gonna call the people and after it ain't gonna be no sequel I think y'all just take the whole thing to see my shit We almost there, we gotta be there before 5.30 In order to pick up these CDs to make this very future deadline So uh, let's see how this turn out Turn the man with the plane He went in the back and picked up that gold mine See that? I, man, I told you the red board wasn't gonna be, it wasn't supposed to be there, but we ain't had time to change it, so uh, it is what it is. You gonna, you gonna get this while I sign it? Yeah, you might wanna get that while you sign it. Anywhere? No, no, this is what I get for letting this nigga finalize the order. I'm telling you now as an artist, if you have a person that you do music with, you better watch all the details, man. Niggas make phone calls to all kinds of shit. Next thing you know, you look like you're a part of something. Hey, let's look at his shoes. Y'all tell me. He's my house shoes. You see, he go with his shoes.